evening, I'm Chris Costa. And I'm Amanda Hill. Last week, Maine's night skies were lit up with a rare show of the northern lights. But what's not rare are the millions of stars, galaxies, and planets which shine above every night. And every Friday, the Versant Astronomy Center at the University of Maine invites the public to learn and enjoy the celestial sights for free. New Center Maine's Christian Harsa has the astronomical story. Bo is in preschool and his favorite subject is going outside. And Friday night, he was outside on a mission. What were you hoping to see out here today? Um, a moon. That moon is actually asteroid 2024 PT5, which is normally in orbit around the sun, but through November 5th is temporarily orbiting Earth, according to NASA. While the 35-foot-wide mini-moon was not visible, the night sky boasted great views, and every Friday, starting at 8 p.m., the Versant Astronomy Center at the University of Maine welcomes the public to enjoy those views for free. It is weather dependent, says Sean Latch, the director of the Astronomy Center. But on a clear night, countless celestial bodies are visible through the center's historic Alvin Clark telescope. In the winter season, we're going to be having some great views of Jupiter um, and Saturn coming up. Memories of seeing those planets are why Will Kiefer works at the center today. It's always so cool because every kid loves astronomy. I've never seen a kid that didn't like it, you know, so they see Saturn and its rings for the first time. Their mind's always blown and it's so cool as it kind of takes me back. Before each Friday outdoor viewing, the planetarium offers viewers a virtual tour of the cosmos. We try to tie it into local things whenever we can. We're talking about the space program. We might tie it into the University of Maine's engineering program and some of the projects they're working on there. Kiefer spent six months creating his own program for the Sunday music shows. It ran perfectly, so it all paid off instantly as soon as the show finished and the round of applause came and there's no issues at all. It felt, it felt really cool. But a virtual experience does not compare to the night sky, which Nero Ganesan says puts life into perspective. When we look at scale of things that are around us, it gives us a feeling that we are a very tiny, tiny part of the universe. So um, it sort of humbles me. In Orono, Christian Harsa, New Center Maine.